sometimes we have nice weather in the UK. Quite cute, they've added some little tables there. <laughs> Just on the way to rehearsals after finishing working this afternoon. Um, yeah, just on the train. About to stop. <laughs> From, from rehearsals, bought these flowers to try and cheer myself up because I'm just feeling totally pissed off and just annoyed. I just feel like since I've moved here to live with to live with Zav in like that was there in 2010. Um, I've just, I'm just away from all my friends. I don't have any friends that are um, local. We're, not really. I've got some of his friends that I've met um, that I know since living here, but I haven't got any of my own sort of friends locally. They're all a good drive away. So I miss having that. I used to live with my friends and um, used to be local. They've had kids now and they're far away. One's moved to... Birmingham and things um, so now I just miss that kind of you can ring up and say Do you fancy a, fancy watching a film or a glass of wine or whatever you know and I haven't got that and it's just wearing on me massively and obviously Zav he will go out with his friends but I'll go with him and sometimes there's girls there sometimes there's not whatever you know it's nice when I'm out with them I appreciate being invited but sometimes it's nice for him to go out with them on their, on his own and it's nice for me to just do something on my own as well. And I just haven't got that. And especially when it comes to IVF. I mean, this is the second weekend now. I've come back. Um, and obviously he's got a plan to meet meet people. Um, I'm invited. I could be there now. But because of that whole IVF. And um, a lot of everyone's plans seem to centre around having a drink. And I'm avoiding alcohol at the moment. And I find it hard to just watch... Um, be around people that are getting drunk and you know uh, it just wears you down doesn't it when you're there sober and not that I'm a massive drinker but still it's just a bit frustrating so um, I come back from my rehearsals this evening and he's at a barbecue with one of his friends it's our friend but his friends um, house I've been invited but I'm just a bit like I can't I don't want to go there and drink why is, I just wish there was someone like around the corner that I knew I could go and sit, maybe that had kids to put them to bed, watch a film or, you know, just sleep over and, I don't know, do girly things or go to the cinema or something that doesn't involve alcohol. Why does everything involve revolve around alcohol? When you're trying to conceive, you avoid it, don't you? He should, I feel like Zav really should be as well. And he's not a massive drinker or anything, but... I just feel like during the IVF cycle it would be nice to have some things to do. Yet yeah, I'm coming home, sitting by myself and really quiet. So, um, yeah. I bought myself some of these to cheer me, cheer me up because they're my favourite flowers. Um, and I sent, sent a picture of it to Zav <laughs> to show him the flowers I've got for the flat. Yeah, obviously I enjoyed my rehearsal, but now coming home it's just like, pfft, hmm, great. 
So, <laughs> just a little bit of the downer at the moment. And, um, yeah. It's, it's good to share the bad and the good, I guess, on these vlogs. So, hmm, this is not a particularly good time. But, yeah. Anyway, that's me over and out. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow for more Vida. <laughs> hope I can get ideas together if anyone's got any ideas please let me know because no one's given me any suggestions and yeah they're running out